Hello friends, welcome back to the How Fast Crafter. This is not a haul channel, I promise. Uh, but I got a bunch of really good coupons from Timu and I got this idea because I want to make dingle dingles and I just couldn't pass up these deals on this stuff. Also, I, I did try to go to my local craft stores, which are all just big box stores, to find all of this stuff and it was stupid expensive. So Timo's prices were a fraction of what Joann's and Michael's had, even on sale. So I'm gonna open this. We're gonna look at it all. It's gonna be fun. My name's Laura, welcome aboard. And let's get this party started. So remember, anything that you see here, you can ask me in the comments and I will send you a link to it. And ooh, there's a coupon code below. Actually, I'm gonna pop it up right here. And if you are a new user to their app, you get 50% off your first order using the app. It's a sweet, sweet deal. So load that cart up because they don't give 50% off coupon. I thought I got a 30% off coupon for my first order months ago and I thought that they gave you 30% off coupons a lot. They do not. You will occasionally get a really good coupon, but it's not that often. That's why when I do, I make these big purchases. So here we go. Here's all the stuff. What do you think? I know, I know, I got a little, I got a little crazy with the uh, with the charms. Look at these sparkly envelopes. Ooh. All right, these are just padded mailing envelopes for Happy Mail. Look at all of this stuff. This is so silly. All right, here we go. Are you ready? So, coupon code. If you want links to any specific thing, let me know. And I will link it for you. You just got a comment below. Uh, and here we go. Uh, the first thing I'm seeing is this little, it's a little storage crate. Uh, let me show you how it opens. I'm going to edit out me opening this, but that's all I'm going to do. Okay, so this is just a little storage crate, and it's super simple to put together. You just pop up the long sides, and then you pop up the short sides, and you snap them in. And it is a great little container. You could put all your glue in it like that. Um, I've got one on my office desk where I've got little post-it notes in there. So super, super handy. I love those things. I got two of them, so there's another one in here somewhere. Uh, another thing I got is a black notebook. So I bought all those gel pens that I showed you in another haul video. And um, I want to, wow, this is like really heavy. Let me open this. Okay, so I I bought this because of those gel pens that I bought. I want to get I want to start like a doodling notebook with the gel pens. Um, wow, this paper is really nice. I may just use this as a writing journal and just use gel pens. I wonder how that would go. So this one was pretty expensive. It was like six dollars and some odd cents. You couldn't pick the pattern, but you got little space guys um, or gals. Maybe it's a space gal. Um, But this is, it was like 639 or whatever, but it's really decent quality. I'm super impressed with this actually. Across the galaxy to meet a better self. Oh, how cute. Okay, well, I love this. What a wonderful, what a wonderful buy. I am happy with that. All right, what else is there? Uh, these are just little envelopes to put Happy Mail bits in. Uh, these are little zippy bags. I think they say thank you. Happy every day, thank you is what they say. Um, that's just to put little bits in. Oh yeah, I did get some, <laughs> I did get some uh, washi stickers. I know. All right, I'm gonna open this. Okay, so first off, look at that. That's adorable. Um, but these are just washi stickers. 
I had to, I think this is the only, oh, these are really cool. They're, they're printed on like textured paper. Whoops. Oh yeah, these are great. Yeah, I love these. All right, so I got some washi stickers because I can't not buy washi stickers. Okay, so as you can see, a lot of this stuff, oh wait, there's some more envelopes for packaging things. Okay, so as you can see, a lot of this is ribbon and beads and things. So let's go. Um, so I got this ribbon and I didn't want I don't want like a whole roll of ribbon. I just wanted a little bit of ribbon. So I love that orange. That's gonna look great in my nocturnal journal. Uh, I got this ribbon, which is like eyelet. It's like eyelet, but it's self-adhesive. So, wow, that's cotton. Nice, feels like cotton. It's either a good fake cotton or it's actually cotton. Uh, I got this to go on the front of journals. It's just ribbon. There's a few of different ones of these. Uh, I got some black lace ribbon for my nocturnal journal. Oh, that's cool. Can you see that? Oh yeah, nice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Love it. All right, um, and then I got these cicada charms. We get cicadas here, but very, 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 very rarely. But we do get them. I think we got them last year. So these cicada charms, that'll be cool on a journal, like a bug themed journal maybe, nature themed journal. Look, they all stack, they're stackable cicadas. Uh, I got this thread. I actually want to check this out. This is for bead making, you know, to make necklaces or whatever, but I got it to use in making journal signatures. And it may be too thin for that, but I could double them up. But anyway, they're really cool colors. Nice. Little organza gift bags. So I always give my daughters-in-law, well, I really only have one, but the other one might as well be. Um, I usually give them little samples at Christmas, and I thought it would be cool to put those in, those little bags, or other little gifts like that. All right, I got these little mushroom charms they're glass and the hole goes through the top so that way I can put other beads on them so that's very exciting I love those and then I got these little charms which are all birds so my grandma name is birdie and I collect little birds. Anything that's a bird, I want to look at it and consider it. I don't like just anything that has birds on it, but I like almost anything that has birds on it. And these bird charms are freaking adorable. Oh my goodness, I love them. All right. Okay, and then the next thing is, oh, these are so cool. So these are also for my nocturnal journal, but they are skull butterflies. That one has a coffin for a body. Oh my gosh. That's hilarious. That's so funny. I love it. So that's for my nocturnal journal as well. I feel like that those should go with my Halloween ones, huh? Uh, and then I got Oh, are these just assortments? Wow, is this like... Okay, this is just an assortment, but I think it's... Whoa. There's a lot. A lot, a lot in here. Oh, there's a little owl. And an airplane, and a key, and a 
another airplane and a heart. <gasps> There's a dinosaur. Oh my gosh. There's a moon. There's a ship wheel. Oh, there's a lizard. There's a butterfly. There's a sewing machine and a little kitty and a fairy and a cat. Whoa, I mean, I don't even know how many are in here. There's gotta be a hundred. Did I order a hundred charms? Doesn't say. It just says that I ordered them in silver. There's glasses and a tree of life. Oh my gosh. Well, that's a huge assortment. I think it was like $4. Um, and then I got these moons and I got an assortment of these. So I got like the bronze and the silver and the gold. Those are cool. Those will be neat on, on a journal cover. Okay. And then I got these little heart charms. Are they hearts? Yeah, they're hearts, but they have the little eye of truth in them. Can you see that? So those are for little journal charms or whatever little thing you want to use them for. I got some little, these are acrylic, so these are plastic, but they're little flower beads. Those are cool. Uh, I got these little flower beads. Oh, those are cute. I think they're called like Thousand Flower or something like that. Um, oh, these are all leaves charms. So they're just leaves. Different leaves. Is that a crane? No, it's a ginkgo leaf. All right, these little flowers. So these are similar to these. These are round and these are teardrop shape, but they're the same design. These are all zodiac symbols. Isn't that funny? And they're just like little, they, they remind me of those bracelets we had in school, the little, you make bracelet with your name on it. Um, let's see. There's some blue beads. I didn't realize I was getting a billion of them, but man, this is so much cheaper than to buy them at Michael's or Joann's. I really looked. So there's a lot of repeats in here. So these are going to go in happy mail. Uh, and then I got these little stickers that say happy mail because that's cute and fun. Oh, I got some tree buttons, and they're just all different. They really packaged these so that I would have to take them out to show you. They're just all different. I swear they're different, she says, as she pulls out all the same. Yeah, those are cute. I like those. All right. Some more little charms. Oh my gosh, these are freaking amazing. So this is also potentially for my nocturnal journal, but they're skeleton unicorns. Oh my God. I just love them. Oh, I love them. Did you, did you get to see that long enough? It's a skeleton unicorn. A unicorn skeleton. I guess. Oh, I love it. Okay. Okay. So good. Oh, there's the other little storage box. Ah, I got this, which is a little beading tool. So you can put it into your little bead and then you can pull, you put your little thread in here and then you can put it in the bead and you can bead it all up. You can put all your beads on here and then you just run your string through there and put the beads on the string. Easy peasy. All right, uh, and then I this is some more lace. So this is like the black lace, but it's like a brownish rosy color. Oh, it's an interesting color. Uh, and then I also got a gray. So it's this lace, 
but in different colors. Uh, oh, I got more little, oh God, I, I feel like I only ordered 20 of things, but I feel like they've sent me 50. So these are more little bags to package stuff up in. Um, more beads. This is an embarrassingly large amount of charms and beads. So these are all, I think there's only five kinds. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Oh, they, they gypped me one. I'm supposed to get another cat. All right, well, it's fine. That's fine. I will... I will tell them about that. Um, and then I got these, which are four. What are these for? It's like I used to know and now I don't. So you can hang your beads off of these. Yes. Right? What did I order these for? Oh man, I had an idea for these and now I've completely forgotten it. All right, well, I'll remember it one day. Uh, and then I, wow, that is a lot of ribbon. I'm gonna have to share this with someone. And then I got this ribbon, which is blue and it's kind of sparkly. That's nice. Um, and then I got a black version, which is not sparkly and a heck of a lot more. So that's cool. That's neat. Uh, I did get recipe cards for my, and a recipe stamp because I'm gonna do um, a recipe journal. So I thought that this would be fun to do. And I feel like I have, yes, there's another set of recipe cards here. I just thought that it would be fun to take my favorite recipes and do this. And maybe what I'll make is a little recipe book for my daughters-in-law and put all of my favorite recipes in there and then they'll have it. That would be fun. Um, more ribbon. I feel like I should just pull out all the ribbon first. I don't know, is it fun to look at the bag and try to figure out what I'm gonna pick up next? All right, so I have this ribbon, which is like gold and black. So that's cool. And then, what is this? Oh, <laughs> it's a little continuous mister. I don't know if it works, but we'll find out. It's better than squeeze, 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 squeeze whenever I need to mist my inks or whatever. Um, and then I got these. Sorry for the crinkling. Oh, that's really pretty. Yeah, nice. So again, these are for journal covers. I did get thicker ones for maybe even using for binding on like skinnier journals. That's cool. I like those colors. I like those colors. And then I got this ribbon, which is darling. And I got this, and I feel like I got a couple of these. There's another one of these, but in yellow. Isn't that cute? Oh, that's gonna be so good on the recipe journal. That'll be good on the recipe journal. Oh, I got this which I think will be really cool Mod Podged on a journal cover, or even you could stitch it in. Oh yeah, maybe you should stitch it in. So that's cool, I like that. That's the back side. There's the front side. It's a little shimmery, neat. Um, and then I got this ribbon as well. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it. It's very plasticky, but I will Mod Podge it on something. So that's cool. Oh, look, more 
beads, mushroom beads. Uh, and then I got little tiny flower beads. They're actually in the shape of flowers. Super little. Uh, I got these, uh, what are these? Doesn't say. Um, they are a stone bead. Uh, clearly, I really had a really great idea for these things. I forget what they're called now, but I did order a lot of them. Oh, wait. You know what? You can do it this way. You can hang your charm off of that, and then that goes like that. Yes. Okay, now that I'm back on track with what I'm looking at. Uh, these are just little charms of a moon and a star. Just thought that these would be fun to kind of hang off of the side of a little dingle dingle. Uh, I did not mean to order this because these brayers are not very good. Um, I have one from Amazon. It's the exact same. Here's the little one, the big ones in the bathroom. So I got these at Amazon. They're not great. When I watched my last gel plate video, I realized when we rolled paint on with this one, the paint like disappeared. When I used my speedball one, it looked correct. So anyway, I didn't mean to order that, but it was in my cart and I placed the order and went, oh dang, oh well, guess I got one. But I can use it for rolling ink on paper. And then I got these little hands and eyes of truth. I forget what the hand is called. Carrie knows. Carrie remembers. She's the one who keeps reminding me of what it is and I forget it. It's, it starts with an H, I think. So here's those. It's a religious symbol, but I forget it. Um, and I got this, I feel like I got this in two colors. Oh, I got more envelopes. Those are smaller. I couldn't figure out what color envelopes I wanted, so I ordered like you know all of the ones that I liked. So whatever. Oh, that's cool. Does that not remind you of 1986 or what? Wow, 84 maybe for sure. Oh yeah. Look at that. Look at that. That's gonna be great on a funky retro journal. All right. Oh, these are all sewing and knitting charms because I know that there's quilters and knitters out there. Aren't those cute? Oh, so adorable. Sorry that I shook my hand at you. That probably doesn't look great on TV. Uh, and then I got this lace trim. And my plan was to use, where does it start? There has to be a start somewhere. There's an end right there, but I don't, maybe this. There you go. Oh, that's really pretty and it feels like cotton. Uh, my plan was to use a distress sprays on this, like ink sprays, because this will take whatever you put on it. Um, Oh, I got these little tags. These are so cute. They're little cutouts. They say handmade. Oh, you can't see it. They say handmade. And it comes with a little jute ribbon to tie them on. Thought that that was sweet. More nocturnal journal. Oh, this is good. I like this one a lot. I like this one way better than the gold one. These are little leaf, man, I don't know why I say feathers or leaves. These are feather charms. They're enameled, a few different colors. They didn't have them in silver or would have gotten silver, but that's okay. More Eye of Truth. Clearly I was on an Eye of Truth kick or an Eye kick. Oh. And some 
Merlot colored trim that we've already seen. Uh oh. Are these the same? No, these are not the same. So this is, again, for the Nocturnal Journal, some black trim. I think that that'd be cool to put on tags or paper or something. And then I got this trim, which is just black, but it's got, it's flat on one side. So that'd be a nice accent. Oh, isn't this beautiful? I love these colors. Oh, beautiful. So again, this is for a journal. It could be the binding on the spine, maybe if it were thin enough. It's gorgeous. This is lace trim and I've got it in I thought I had another color. Maybe I, yeah, maybe I didn't order that color. But I've got it in gray again for the Nocturnal Journal. And then another trim for the Nocturnal Journal. And this is similar to this one, but it's not the exact same. See? They are not the same. I put my hand under there. So. Sorry if you couldn't see that. I've got you zoomed in and I forget. And then, pom-poms! Oh, I'm so excited about this one. I think this will be cool, like maybe even on the bottom of a journal cover. You could have your pom-poms on the bottom. Oh, I'm so excited about the pom-poms. And I got this little daisy lace trim. And then these are all the same, but different colors. So the blue is all the same. These are all different colors. Let me find, here's an end. So again, it's just trim. Oh, this is gonna look so good on tags, I think. Wow, that's really glued. Here we go. Oh, that's really cool. Just, I mean, even just a little piece on a tag, you know, like even if you just put a little bit like that. Nice. Nice. Very excited. Oh my gosh, we're down to the last thing. Whatever could this be? Are they playing cards? They are Gypsy Witch fortune telling playing cards. Let's open them. All right, so. So the cool thing is on each card it says like, the eye when near denotes great interest taken by friends. When distance, it signifies suspicion. So they have these just like, I mean, it's, it's almost like a fortune that you get from a fortune cookie. A more is a sign that someone is looking at you with great love and longing. The rider is a sure sign of good news unless alongside of six, eight, 11, or 13. The park foretells a new love when very near. If distant, far false friends. So my plan was to alter these um, because they're just very cool and I think that they would be neat altered. So, neat, those are cool. I'm very excited about those. I know, I got a lot of cards to alter. I know, it's fine. All right, so let's pull all this stuff back in so that we can get a good picture of it all. We can see all the things and the stuff. Look at it all, it's ridiculous. There's so much here. 
All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed this haul video. It's been a ton of fun to go through all of my stuff with you. Ooh, did we look at this? I mean, I guess we did, but let's look at it again. Because that's really beautiful. Oh, it's like sparkly. Nice. That's great. This notebook, I am super impressed with. The only way I would be more impressed is if it had a um, an elastic closure like a moleskin. But it does have a bookmark. You can't beat that, my friends. Very cool. All right. I'm going to go put all this stuff away and then make some art craft things. I hope that you all have a wonderful day. And thanks for watching this haul video. Bye.